Their name is synonymous with one of New York's most notorious crime families. But after leaving witness protection, former mafia enforcer Richard Cant Cantarella and his family wound up right here in the valley. And then in a twist you really won't believe, their former life and the city of Scottsdale took center stage in a reality show. Monique Riego is sitting down with the family at their valley home. Monique. It was a great life. There ain't nothing we couldn't have. A way of life most of us only know from the movies. I'm funny how? I mean, funny like I'm a clown, I amuse you. But as a former mobster with the Bonanno crime family, Richard Cantarella and his son Paul lived it. Cantarella as a captain and enforcer, Paul as a Bonanno family soldier. Got arrested in 2002. Cantarella facing life in prison for his alleged ties to a string of mafia hits. Paul looking at 20 years for racketeering. Both decided to cooperate. Paul heading into witness protection as Cantarella waited in prison. I chose uh, to, to be loyal to my family rather to my boss. Back then, he never imagined he and his wife Loretta would one day end up here. My son picked the state. He came here and he found a home and he, he loved it. In 2004, Paul left witness protection for sunny Scottsdale, Arizona. It was like paradise to me. I mean, the, the palm trees, your pool was yeah, open all right. year. Cantarella followed, going from the big house to the Phoenix Burbs. There's a lot of money out here. I don't know where it comes from. I never saw so many Bentleys. It amazes him. <laughs> this actually would be a haven for the mafia. <laughs> They've since traded a life of crime for a legit family business. Their valley car washes now the backdrop for their latest endeavor. They probably use the rock in the Unprotected, a reality show on the Oxygen Network. So we had to enter the witness protection program. The show mixing the family's tight bond with some of their East Coast attitude. I'll take that dog and tie him to my bump and I'll drag him. We own the car wash that you reviewed on Yelp. Scottsdale Lake ladies are a little uptight. But we had to ask, after spending more than a decade distancing themselves from their past, could a reality show out them to the wrong people? By the time I came out of prison, it was all said and done. My boss cooperated, my underboss cooperated, so there was really nothing to me to be concerned about. Loretta, more nervous about mean soccer moms than mafia men. I just thought they would perceive us, you know, they wouldn't like us as much. I wanted them to see another side of us. But if they expected animosity, what they got was curiosity. People are mesmerized by the mob. He started telling everybody. Yeah. Everyone, <laughs> everyone was loving it. Paul's kids, now 17 and 18, grew up here. And this is what I'm used to, and this is what I fell in love with, so I feel like I'm the one that's kind of the outcast of the family. <laughs> yeah, I'm more blended. She's a true depiction of Scottsdale. Now, with everything out in the open, the Valley helping the Cantarellas create a new legacy to go along with that famous last name. We like it here. We have no reason to leave. The show's first season just ended, but if you still want to binge watch it, you can do that online. Monique Riego, 12 News at 10.